New York's Department of Environmental Con Conservation says help is on the way to reduce phosphorus runoff in Lake Champlain. Our Alec Lasham tells us what new tool the department's rolling out and how much money Peru is getting. Nearly 40 years old, this critical infrastructure facility in Peru is one of many in the North Country that needs new upgrades to meet incoming new state requirements. For the most part, it's it's failing infrastructure that impacts our our water quality. Commissioner Basil Sagos of New York's Department of Environmental Conservation, or DEC, says the agency has finally completed the Lake Champlain watershed implementation plan. It sets up the next round of uh, really important actions and that is our uh, financial investments in this body of water. It's been years in the making, all in an effort to reduce phosphorus from getting into the lake, a major focus for environmental leaders. Also announced Monday, new money for Peru's wastewater facility. It protects all the, the waste from your homes, um, businesses uh, that are tied onto it and ends up coming into your lakes and streams. Courtney Tatro with the town of Peru says the money will go towards new equipment, some meant to lower their phosphorus output, which he says has been slashed in half over the last two years. We have a requirement to add UV disinfection to our facility, so we do need to make some upgrades to uh, help with that. He says the town has roughly $3.5 million for the project so far, but with a price tag of $25 million, he says they are now waiting on lawmakers to provide some additional support. We're with hopes that we get the rest of our funding this year and uh, we can go out to, to bid and start construction uh, 2025. In Peru, Alec Lasham, Channel 3 News.